extras. In this video, I'm just going to show you how you can load new nozzles into Painter X3. Now, just going to go over here. You could, of course, use the file open command to open the file. But the key thing here is actually just go to Window, Media Library Panels, and Nozzles. It's actually displayed here. So just go to the right side and load nozzle. That's the key thing, load nozzle file. I've got a file here, RIF file. It's already, uh, now that was actually created quite a while back now in Painter, brr, Painter 5, Painter 6, whatever. But the format is still supported, perfectly okay for X3 as well. And you can find lots and lots of them all around the web, as well as on the graphicextras.com website. Lots of RIF files there. So once you've actually selected that, just click open. Now, initially, you don't see it. You think, ugh, that's done nothing. We'll just go over to the image hose and you can actually just apply it. Here's the actual nozzle being applied. But what you can do is just go over here, right side, and add nozzle to library. Click OK. Now, the nozzles are not stored in nozzle libraries on the Graphic Extras website, mainly because the nozzle library format is quite large. NZL files were always 30 or 40 megs, whatever, even for a couple of files. So basically, I've just stored them as RAF files instead. So uh, quick and easy way, just import them in, and then you'll just see them there in the, there. and of course, comply them in numerous ways. Obviously, change the size apply effects to them, etc. Okay, hope you found this tutorial of interest.